What's up guys, it's Mike. It's Dan. It's Yi. We talk a lot about oppressive regimes and we've been talking a lot about North Korea as of late and this story just came out. This is kind of crazy. I mean, I've read about this kind of stuff before, but it's still happening. I thought maybe it just happened a few times, but it's still apparently happening. Uh, we know people get executed in, uh, in North Korea. Yeah. But can you imagine being one of the top advisors to the little Kim? Yeah, little. I'll call the, him little Kim. Are you sure you want to do that? I'll call, uh, I'll call him little John Un. Are you sure? Are you sure you want to disrespect him? Yeah, pretty much. I mean, he's taking some extreme measures the way he's Yeah, well, this guy is insane. People. I mean, these are his top, he executed some of his top advisors, his relatives for petty. Here's why it, it, it could happen to me. Right. Because I could be doing any of those things that he executed oh. these people for. <laughs> I can be doing that. First of all, yeah. I, I would fall asleep at yeah. meetings. Yeah, he executed someone for falling asleep at his meeting. Yep. That's reason number one. Yeah. Dang. And, and the second one is supposedly one guy, again, one of his top advisors, this is recent, got executed for suggesting um, that they improve the country's agricultural system. Apparently, that idea somehow undermined the little Kim that mm -hmm. you said. I didn't yeah. say that. I'm just repeating what you yeah. said. Little, 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 little Kim. Yeah. So much that they were like, he needs to get executed. I mean, I fall asleep at meetings all the time. Oh, you I, gotta, I was at a meeting two days ago where I fell asleep. Can you imagine? Yeah. I cannot imagine where like, I, 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 because I nod off so often. Right. In class, meetings, driving, you know, <laughs> sometimes, I don't Dude. know. So I'm like yeah. whiplashing myself and yeah. all of a sudden I like come to and they're like, yeah, you're getting executed. Yeah. I'm like, no, you, you, what, what happens is you'd wake up already like, with, you'd wake up tied. And you're like, what's going on? Oh, you're dying today. That's basically what would happen. Jeez. Yeah. I think this is what happens when one person gets ultimate power and he's yeah. like, you know what? I'm not happy with this guy. This guy really made me angry. You know what I'm right. gonna do? He needs to go now. He needs to. Go. Yeah. And, and of course, why they do that is he is making, again, he's making an example out of these people right. in order to keep his society. They say homogenous. I say he basically keep it under control. This his is control. literally how a tyrant yeah. in the old days will do it. They'd be like, yeah. He went against me, like, I'm gonna kill him. This reminds me of Dong Zhuo. He was one of the oppressive warlords. He almost killed, like, yeah. Liu Bei, uh, yeah, like, yeah, whatever, yeah. In, in the novels, whatever. He invited people mm -hmm. to a banquet, oh. and everyone's, that, all his top officials were there, and he would behead one of them and throw their head into the jar of oh, wine. Yeah. Wine, okay, okay. And then, yeah. and then he would pour wine for them with the blood in it, like, drink it. Yeah. For the other people. Yeah, and, and that's he, how he would yeah. show intimidate his officials. Well, similar what? to that, guess how guess how these two advisors died? They got killed by anti-aircraft weapons. Do you know you don't know what that is? What do you think that is? That anti-aircraft. I mean definitely heavy machinery, I don't know. That that means if it shoots you, you just blow up. Whatever what do you think that is? Like a bazooka? I mean What's that? Bazooka? It's like it's like these shells, like an AA. Yeah. You ever played Command and Conquer? It's, it's just these like really big big bullets. Yeah, I mean things that are shoot down an aircraft. So not only does he have a bad temper, but he has a unique, cruel right. way of executing people. I just feel like why do you have to do that? Why do you have to be like this? Some people say every so often, you know, they go through a period where he needs to make a lot of people an example. That's why this year or last year they said that the public executions went from 30 to 60, because I think right now people are saying he's he's kind of worried, I don't know about what, because... Well, he's always worried because he literally, he's... Everyone's being oppressed, yeah. except for like the 1%. Right. And, you know, everyone, I'm sure everyone's trying to, like, because every so often you hear about, oh, hey, like uh, South Korea uh, have to, you know, to turn back North Korean defectors, right. and North, North Koreans, like, escaping to... They're basically running, trying to run from the country. Yeah. Yep. So, of course, he's worried. He's running this little... Right. Little nook of a of a just this totalitarian right. terror zone. Right, and that's probably why he's he's you know he's killing people for watching K drama. Yeah, I would exactly. imagine if I were this person, I treat other people like this. I treat my top advisor, I treat my family, I treat my people like this. Of course, I would be paranoid yeah. because, and I feel like that's why he executes so many people because he's like because he's like this. He's he knows that other people hate him. There's got to be some people who hate him, this, even if he get they get brainwashed not to. This is why I'm I'm a little confused about why it hasn't happened but if you think about every tyrant right. there's always assassination attempts 
Be Hitler, right? Uh, a lot of failed ones, like yeah. Hitler, Mussolini, Qin Shi Huang, yeah. failed uh, ones. Yeah, but yeah. I'm thinking there must be some who try to kill this guy. Well, this is what he does to prevent that from happening. Yo, but do you think his family is even afraid? Of family. Course, he killed his family before. Did you not oh, know yeah. that? No, I didn't know that. He executed no the way. first person he killed with the artillery gun was his uncle, no, who was one way. of his top advisors, who oh. fell, who again fell asleep in his meeting. Okay, that's it. Are so, you serious? Yeah. If he's willing to make his family an example, I mean, that's it. That's beyond. I mean, I, that guy's. No, I'd this guy, we already know this guy's insane. Insane. Anyway, I, I still don't understand why some people want to go to North Korea for vacation. I, I would never go there anyway. All right, guys, let us know your thoughts on the story. Thanks for watching, everybody. See you. Bye.